has fought Superman more than a several times. Superman has proven to be ruthless and merciless towards his enemies at times, and this has brought Batman to try and stop him. Batman has defeated him using a kryptonite arrow, kryptonite shard, kryptonite ring, red solar lamps, and grenades, and a bat suit lined with kryptonite. Cyborg is a powerful threat to Batman and his gadgets, but that's why on the day they met, Batman installed a virus in the cyborg, which he can use anytime to stop the cyborg, immobilize him, or even kill him. But Batman does not kill. Also, Batman's tech allows him to stop the guy from even moving. Batman in a normal bat suit has already defeated Wonder Woman. But to fix a more powerful version of Wonder Woman, he plans on using augmented reality or holograms to make Wonder Woman think that she is fighting someone. Therefore, she'll get tired in a few hours of fighting holograms, and then Batman can knock her out. Flash is the fastest man alive and would probably face attack Batman before he could think, but Batman has made a device, basically a lightning rod, that absorbs the Flash's lightning, nullifying his speed and thus defeating him. Then, he'll have no trouble beating him up. Batman also has meta-human power dampeners at his disposal, so he can, ins uh, so he can install them in his suit, so the Flash won't be able to even touch him or phase attack him without losing his powers. Even the Flash's lightning classifies as a meta power, so it'll be useless. Batman also has Mr. Freeze's cold gun, which shoots ice, that is, every speedster's main weakness. Aquaman is nearly un invulnerable, but he still does have a nose, and like Golden Age. One of Batman's most famous villains is the Scarecrow, who uses a gas that causes the one who breathes it in to see their worst fears in the common thing. In a common thing, for example, if uh, there's per there's a person in front of you, but you may see a zombie and scream and run. But Batman has engineered the gas to make Aquaman hydrophobic, that is, afraid of water. Water is Aquaman's power source, so that means Batman just has to stall until Aquaman passes out due to dehydration and then he can beat him up. For the second alien in the Justice League, Batman has engineered a nanite virus which instantly will set Martian Manhunter's body on fire. As I assume you know, Martians are susceptible to fire. If any of you would think that uh, Martian Manhunter would just hack into Batman's mind and destroy it, but as proven in the Justice League animated TV show, Martian Manhunter was successfully neutralized by Dr. Destiny, a telepathic villain. But Dr. Destiny wasn't able to defeat Batman in his own lair, explaining how strong Batman mentally is. 